Number 1. Melina is a Italian drama or war movie release in 2000. In 1941, Renato was 13 years old and although the world was at war, nothing ever happened in this sleepy village in Sicily. Until the day he discovered something that would change his life forever. Melina, the beautiful young war widow who was the obsession of every man and the envy of every woman. Because of her, Renato will come to learn all of life's lessons and find himself in places he never could have imagined. Number 2. Queen of Hearts is a Danish thriller or drama movie release in 2019. Annie, a successful lawyer, lives in a beautiful modern home with her two daughters and her physician husband Peter. One day, Gustav, Peter's troubled teenage son from a previous relationship, comes to live with them, and Annie forms an intimate bond with him that jeopardizes her perfect life. What initially seems like a liberating move for her soon turns into a disturbing story of power, betrayal, and responsibility, with devastating consequences. Number 3. The Teacher is an American romance or drama movie release in 2013. Dinah Watts is an English teacher at Westbrook High School in Austin, Texas. A long time and continuing undisclosed issue between her and her mother may be only one factor in Dinah looking for love in the wrong place. That place is at school, as she has just embarked on a secret affair with one of her students, Eric Tull. This relationship is the most fulfilling she's had in quite some time. A few incidents and the first real close call in being caught leads to Dinah calling off the affair several months in, as she finally comes to the understanding that being caught would certainly mean the end of her teaching. Number 4. The Boy Next Door is an American erotic thriller movie release in 2015. The classic literature teacher Claire Peterson lives alone with her teenage son Kevin in a house in the suburb. She is separated from her husband Garrett Peterson since she has found he had an affair with a co-worker in Los Angeles. Garrett wants to have a fresh restart with Claire but she is reluctant and prefers to stay alone. When the handsome nephew of her next-door neighbor Noah Sinbon loses his parents in a car accident, he moves to the house and befriends Claire and Kevin. Noah seems to be an adorable young man and soon there is a sexual tension between Claire and he and one rainy night they have one night stand. On the next morning, Claire regrets but Noah becomes obsessed for her and shows his real personality. Number 5. Lifeguard is an American romance or drama movie release in 2013. 29-year-old Lee is on leave from her job in New York City after feeling a sense of emptiness and sadness in her life. Lee has returned to her parents' home, to her high school job as a lifeguard and to her high school friends still in town. 
But Lee continues to struggle in finding happiness since her parents don't approve and she's bullied by local kids at the pool. Lee finds an almost like kindred spirit in high school student little Jason, but when their friendship turns into an illicit relationship, her friends don't approve and even more tragedy awaits Lee in her personal journey towards. Number 6. Notes on a Scandal is American drama movie release in 2006. Barbara Covert is a lonely and bitter teacher at a high school, nearing retirement. She spends her time writing up a diary and caring for an elderly cat. When Sheba Hart joins the faculty, Barbara is interested in the young woman. Barbara befriends her, and Sheba invites Barbara to lunch with the family. Barbara writes up scornful remarks about the husband, and is particularly caustic about their son, Ben, who has Down syndrome. The drama begins when Barbara discovers that Sheba is having an affair with 15-year-old student, Stephen Connolly. Barbara sees that she can coerce and influence Sheba. She demands that Sheba break it off. When Sheba fails to, Barbara strikes out, disclosing the affair to other faculty. The school acts, and Sheba is let go. Barbara is also fired for not disclosing the business to officials. Number 7. The Door in the Floor is a drama or romance movie release in 2004. The movie is about a marriage between two smart people who are too afraid, or perhaps too cruel, to fight out in the open. They play a deep game of psychological chicken, all the more hurtful because they know so well what buttons to push. They lost their two sons were killed in a car crash, that Marion in some ways blames dead, that in middle life they've had a daughter, Ruth, to try to heal the loss and that the loss was not healed. Now Ted proposes to hire a young student as his assistant for the summer. This is Eddie. Because we have already visited the upstairs corridor lined with photographs of their two dead boys, we notice immediately that Eddie looks a lot like the older boy. Marion notices, too, as she is intended to.